Hey, Night Owl here. Today we're going to go over a couple of things on the update that's coming up. We're also going to go ahead and show you a new Mega Knight deck along with a nice little shop purchase. Let's get it done. Hey, welcome to the channel today on this nice and sunny, actually it's super rainy outside, it's miserable weather, holy cow, the weather sucks. I'm going to show you a couple replays here while we talk a little bit about this, uh, <laughs> about this update, man. This new touchdown mode, they streamed yesterday live, it was actually pretty awesome to watch. Um, there's some unique things in this update that um, I think opens the door for a ton of new possibilities for Supercell. I think that this new mode creates an avenue for kind of other new modes to jump into the game because once they start with this little touchdown mode, I mean, they can add so many other things that I actually never even thought of them being able to add. Okay, so first things first, let's talk about the touchdown mode. It looks like, obviously, you guys have seen it now. Um, you can plant things on your side, and all you gotta do is get one guy across the field, which looks pretty difficult. They, they were struggling with it back and forth. I know I was rooting for OJ and Eclipse because, you know, I know them a little bit better, but I was hoping that they would pull something out. They did not, <laughs> unfortunately. They got rocked. It looked like Antrax and Alvaro won the whole thing. Good for them. So this opens up the door for some of the quests that I see as well. Can you imagine, for example, a quest that requires you to get an Ice Spirit, <laughs> Ice Spirit, all the way across the field and score a touchdown? I don't know. It's probably impossible, <laughs> but I don't know. I can see it happening, I guess. I can see it happening. Um, <laughs> the other thing that I was thinking with this new uh, update mode, I wish there was kind of a 1v1 aspect of it as well. I know it's 2v2, but 1v1 would be cool too, just because I'm not sure that you're always going to get a good teammate or whatever. It's just the same thing as 2v2. Anyway, pretty sweet update. I'm pretty excited about it. I hope it comes out soon. I think they're going to release some more little sneak peeks in the coming few days. and. Who's to know when the update's going to hit? I know that there's some news that it's going to hit probably this week, which would be so sweet. Um, anyway, either way, we're going to get rocking that update, and I'm, I'm jacked up about it. Let's open up this crown chest here. We might as well, since it's there. <laughs> and I hardly get any crown chests anymore, because I can't seem to win any battles. <laughs> I keep getting matched up against these crazy loonies. Um, and then... Let me show you this replay, and then we're going to buy that little flying machine thing in the shop. Um, so I showed you the one. Let's go ahead. Let's watch this one, the Max Royal Giant here. Uh, I just beat the Max E-Bars. So I switched over to this Mega Knight deck because I was losing with my regular um, Hog Mini P.E.K.K.A. deck. So I switched over to this Mega Knight deck and won three in a row. So I'm happy about that because I lost eight in a row with my last deck. So I don't know if I'm on the losing side of things, but I've been facing some pretty high up guys towards the end of the season here for some reason. Either way, we're going to rock this thing. I want to show you this, <coughs> a couple of these plays in here. Um, so he puts his, uh, his musketeer in the back. Let me put this on double speed just so we can speed up this replay. No reason to mess around. And here's his biggest push that he had of the whole game. I managed to put my ice going down because I didn't have zap in rotation was able to take out all the bats and everything and I think I stopped that fairly decently he was completely out of elixir so I was able to get my hog in there and get a few shots off I didn't want to drop anything else just because I knew he was gonna drop his minions I figured if I dropped my bats he would just take them out no big deal check this out right here oh this is where he brings okay not the play yet not the play that I want to show you guys yet so Mega Knight boom take out his bats he has zero elixir so I rock his tower here with the Mega Knight and then he thinks he's going to get some fatty thing going. Nothing. Because got, he's got no elixir, man. So it worked out really well. We were able to take his tower down all the way to 949. Check that lightning out. Smoke those E-bars right there. I wasn't even trying to smoke him, but he happened to play some right there. I just wanted to take out his musketeer in the tower. So we actually gain advantage on him right there in the match. He drops his royal... I just... He drops his royal giant on the other side. So he knows he's got that tower. So I know he's got something. He's got a fireball, obviously able to take that out we got a Mega Knight coming in we got an E-Wiz coming in we're able to get to the tower but he is up on damage a little bit and of course you know as a Royal Giant user he's gonna drop it in the middle so he drops it in the middle I'm ready for it a little bit I am he gets our tower down all the way to 805 and I don't know if he lagged out or whatever but we pretty much took his tower easily even though 
I think we could have taken him out either way, but we rocked that guy's world there. It was pretty sweet. So let's go over. We're going to open up this little flying machine offer. Just one of them. Only because I got to get my... Oh, let's open up that epic chest too, dude. We might as well. Only because my flying machine is... uh not tournament standard yet where is that little critter and we got to get him up close to that tournament standard as soon as we do that i'm going to make a deck and we are going to go in there and make it happen so let's open up this epic chest first i guess <laughs> hope hoping for some what do we want balloons we want balloons definitely tornadoes horrible don't want tornadoes lightnings not bad clones who doesn't want clones when you spend gold on an epic chest <laughs> dude are you kidding me? Alright, so let's buy one of these. We might as well. Um, I think it's a really bad value, so don't do it. But it is what it is, guys. It is what it is. Ice Spirits. There's some... Z Ooh! Actually, pretty excited about the Zaps. Minion Hordes don't care about. And this is our Flying Machines. We got 28 with... Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> what? Whoa! Wait! We got 85 of those bad boys? That's awesome! That's pretty cool. So, <laughs> that's pretty awesome. So, what does that get us up to on that? Let's go check that out real quick. Um, so, that gets us to level 6 only. So, we got to get to level 7. What's tournament standard? Level 7? Ouch. We just need a few more. Like, 34 more. We'll get there soon, guys. Don't you worry. So, we might as well show you this deck since we have it here. Hopefully, in a live battle, we can make this happen right now. Let's get into it. Boom, PJJ-27, he's my homeboy, he's going to let us win. So, the last three battles, since I was like tilting so hard, I'd just come off eight losses in a row, I attacked right away, and it seemed to actually work out pretty decently for me, I didn't struggle too much. So, this battle, I'm going to play a little bit more reserved. I'm just going to throw a Hog Rider in there, see what kind of damage we can get, see what he has to protect against the Hog. That worries me a little bit. He has Executioner, which worries me only because um, I'm thinking he might have Tornado. So let's go E-Wiz <clears throat> right here. And then we're going to go Mega Knight up on this grill. Uh, boom. Perfect. Oh, crap. What are you doing over there? Mega Knight is focused on the wrong set of things. Boom. Take that out. Take that out. And it looks like we're going to get in there with a nice little Mega Knight. Hopefully, we can get a shot on the tower. It doesn't look like we're going to. He's going to go ahead and block it with his miner, which is a good block. It is. But as soon as that miner dies, he knows I'm going to go to town with my hog. And I'm probably going to throw my goblins behind the hog as well. Because um, I think they'll be able to get to the tower as well with the hog rider. Oh, there's his tornado. There it is, boys and girls. There it is. Dude, I knew it. But we were, because we put the goblins there, we were able to get a little more damage than I'd than I would have gotten had I just thrown the hog down. So that worked out pretty well. We do got the tower down to 1250, which is great. Now we just got to prepare for his little executioner again, because that's what he's going to put down clear in the back. He's probably going to throw the exact same push down. <laughs> Giant executioner. So we're going to get ready with the same exact things as well. Boom. We're going to have to waste a little elixir here, I think, actually. Very unfortunate. Um, boom. There we go. Let's go like that, that, and zap that. Hopefully we can get those minions taken out quick. Yes, 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 perfect. Mega Knight, stay alive, buddy. Stay alive. All you got to do is stay alive just for a little bit. Take that Executioner out. Get in there. Get a hit on that tower. Oh, he's going to tornado that whole thing together. That was a good tornado. Come on, get there. Two shots. One top shot, two shots. Nope, one shot. <laughs> We're going to try and predict that. We messed that up. Let's go Mega Knight right here. Boom. Yeah. We're going to get in there with the Mega Knight right off the bat. And then we're going to Lightning his Executioner this time. Lightning. Hopefully he drops something else. I don't think he's going to. Boom, boom. Perfect. Oh! That was a good play with his Giant, actually. Let's, um, let's zap those guys. And then we're going to go like that. And then, oh, come on. We got this, guys. We got this. I got faith in us. Come on. We got to stop that Giant, though. That's a big problem. <laughs> Crap! Crap! Get in there. Get in there. All we gotta do is get to the tower. One shot. Come on! Oh my gosh, you guys. Tornadoes are like the bane of my existence, guys. Bane of my existence. We're not gonna go out on a loss like that. We're gonna get in there. We're gonna get another battle. We're gonna take care of this. 
I did manage to get to Challenger 3. So we are going to get a Challenger 3 chest. I'm going to push as high as I can tonight, but I don't know if it's going to be uh, very well. <laughs> very, very easy. I seem to be getting faced up against these guys that all have like my direct counters, <laughs> which sucks. Oh, I should have used goblins there. I should have saved the bats for whatever he has. Ooh, so glad. The tombstone, absolutely. He misplaced the tombstone. So that worked out pretty well for us. We'll zap that just for fun. And it looks like now we're in a bit of a pickle. So we're going to go like this. And we're going to go lightning on that as well. Oh my heck. Take it out, please. Please take it out. No! No! Oh my heck. I thought we had that balloon taken out. So we traded towers there. That was horrible. We're just going to let him go to town on us a little bit. Man, those lava pups and those minions do some work. Ouch! We don't really have... Mega Knight's not going to do anything in this battle. Very unfortunate. So let's go Ice Golem back here. We'll just set up for a slow push. Nice and easy. We'll put some bats. Just don't zap my bats. My bats are going to take out your little Mega Minion. Oh, there you go. Here we go. Let's go... Let's go Hog Goblins right in the middle here. Hopefully he drops something crazy. Nope. He's going to drop that. We should get a little damage on the tower, hopefully. That works out pretty well. But I have nothing to prepare against. I have nothing against his balloon right now. I got my E-Wiz and my Bats, I guess. So we're just going to worry about that. Let's go here. Ice Golem again. There we go. Let's go Bats. And then let's do an E-Wiz right off the bat. There we go. Come on, come on. Come on, bats, do your thing. Yes, that's what I'm talking about, bats. Get in there. Get that done. There we go. That was good defense. I'm happy with that, 100%. And then we should be able to take that tower down with that hog rider, hopefully. Yes, 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 yes. E-Wiz hog rider. Clutch play, people. Clutch play. Let's go Mega Knight in here. He doesn't even know what's going to hit him. He thinks he's going to get ready for another Lava Hound push, but not on girlfriend. We're going Mega Knight right off the bat. Oh, dang it. Come on, Mega Knight. Get in there. Boom. Ooh, and it stomped his tombstone. Did you guys see that play? That was awesome clutch. Um, just don't go balloon yet. There we go. Oh, Hog Rider right off the bat for sure. I think we can three crown this guy right now. Um, we'll zap those guys away. Taken care of. Taken care of, people. That's Lava Loon. <laughs> that works out really well. Woo! <laughs> just so excited I want Matt. I've been losing so much lately. <laughs> hurts my feelings <laughs> okay anyway thank you guys so much for dropping by the channel today hope you like what you saw be sure and subscribe uh, we're gonna have some great videos coming out soon some more build projects that are gonna be awesome um some ones that are gonna be some good ones that we can test on some things too so you'll check that anyway take it easy guys and good luck